So congratulations, I watched the film last night. It's a beautiful movie. I think the thing that really stuck out to me is how much emotion came from the, the leading actresses and how much wasn't actually shown in terms of you don't show the daughter actually get kidnapped or, or the reveal or even um, in prison the face of the killer. Of the killer. Yeah, and I love that and I wanted to kind of ask you about those choices and how you kind of chose to, to do that and, and still let the emotion carry uh, without having to visually see those things. Good question. Uh, um, and, I'm, and thank you for acknowledging that because yeah. it was it's a battle. Yeah. I mean, it's a choice. It could be, you could it's easily choice, show that, but I like choice. that you didn't show that. Yeah, no, I mean, I, 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 had a, I had an idea that I was going to maybe not hear the killer's monol um, uh, confession, mm -hmm. even though we shot it. But going into it, I had a feeling we weren't going to hear it. Mm -hmm. And the reason being is because you know. Yeah. We know that story. Mm -hmm. we, we, see it, we see it all the time, and especially in film and TV. We sensationalize that violence. We, it's, it's, it's easy drama. Mm -hmm. And uh, I, I felt an in responsibility to the character and characters. Deb doesn't know. She wasn't there. She didn't witness her, the abduction of her daughter, her murder. You know, she's, she's really uh, living with the unknown. And that was really, I thought, really important. Because I was, I felt everything, every decision should be really connected to her experience, not to Bridget, the daughters, yeah. and to her responsibility to her grandson, yeah. and that's what the story is about. So while the film, in its first act, kind of sets up what might have then um, initiated a, quite a conventional murder mystery yeah. story, mm -hmm. we made the decision to turn that and go the other way into what really happens, which is you have to get on with it. You have to get on with life. Yeah. And that journey of her like having that hope where she still checks, but she knows and probably imagined the worst anyway. You know, at the end, you know, when, when um, they, they're driving off and you, you see those tears, for, is that, do you want the audience to feel that kind of, that release that she's probably feeling, right? When now she can finally have that well, knowledge and What, what did you go. feel? Um, feeling in terms of, that there's still hope, right? That her life, she's moving to this mm -hmm. new place and to start over, but that, you know, that that's part of her story. Like, you know, th these, and the whole title even for me, American Woman, it's like, she goes through so much pain in this movie, but there's still lightness and there's still hope. Is that what you hope the audience is taking at the end in that final scene when you're kind of, she's driving off with her, the tears in her eyes, but still happiness in there somewhere? Uh, it's, well, you've just described it exactly. I mean, there was, it, there was a myriad of different mm -hmm. things. There's a layering of feeling there, but resilience, the fight to get there, to make that decision, to leave, to go to, to something she doesn't know, she doesn't know where that's going to lead. You know, we, we always had ideas about where, what, what that would eventually become. You know, my head, she moves to New Mexico. Her son, uh, the grandson grows up to be actually quite a gifted Music singer songwriter and mm -hmm. she turns and she works with horses I mean that's what kind of what <laughs> it was in my head it was going to be but it takes a, a long a lot longer to get there than yeah. she thought and I, I think it's not a it's not a happy ending but it is a hopeful ending yeah and that's I, what I wanted that people to, to, to walk away with is that live in your truth well it comes across it was a beautiful journey and, and I appreciate you taking the time to share this with our audience thank you thank you